Well, a wild one in Seattle. We had to go to two overtimes before the Huskies held off Utah. 77-73 with Eldridge Rakasner. Roxy Bernstein with you. And in the second overtime, Eldridge, the three-point shooting for Washington was the difference. Well, Dejon Davis hit a big one, you know, right out of the gate, not known for his three-point shooting, but there wasn't a shot during the entire game that was bigger than that. And then right after that, Cole Basima knocked down his three. We know he can shoot the rock, but he had been quiet most of the game. Two huge threes by the Washington Huskies. And the Huskies have won five of their last six, and the Pac-12 leading scorer, Terrell Brown Jr., who doesn't hit many threes, hit one there, his third 30-point game of the season. Now this young man has been absolutely phenomenal. I'm going to say it one more time. He's the best story in all of college basketball. He just flat out gets it done. He said the elbow in the paint is his office, and the coaches say that's your office. I was go to work out there, and that's exactly what he did. And for Utah, Brandon Carlson, who returned Wednesday from the appendectomy, led the Utes in the ball game with 18 and really had a strong game. His skill set is very unique and it's impressive. At seven foot, he can shoot the three, he can put it on the floor, he can play with his back to the basket. 18 points, seven for 13 from the field, but he didn't have a lot of help from other guys. And as a result, tonight, uh, today rather, Utah comes in second place. So five out of six for Washington. They're six and three in the league now. 11 and eight overall. Utah's now dropped 10 in a row. But Terrell Brown Jr. continues to light it up with a fantastic a game again for the Huskies. He's in consideration for Pac-12 Player of the Year. And his story, like I said, is just, it's unreal for all the kids out there that don't get scholarships coming out of high school. It's not over. Just take a look at Terrell Brown Jr. So the Huskies have it rolling here at home as they get it done again today. From our partner Eldridge Rakasner and our Pac-12 crew, 77-73 UW over the Utes. Roxy Bernstein, so long from Seattle.